Manuel, congratulations, you've just signed for Port Vale Football Club. How excited are you? Yeah, I'm really happy. Um, buzzing. Can't wait to get started and work with the boys. Hopefully we can achieve the goals that we've set. Now, what, how did the move come about? I'm guessing you spoke to the gaffer, Neil Aspin. What did he have to say to you to uh, make you want to join the club? Uh, yeah, the gaffer was a big reason why I joined the team. Um, spoke to me as soon as my season ended. Uh, expressed to me uh, the changes he wanted to make at the team and um, said he was a fan of how I play. And you know, I've, um, when he was a manager at Gateshead, I played against his teams. I'm really impressed with how he um, sets us up. And yeah, I just wanted to be part of what he had going here. I came here, stadium was great. Uh, the staff were here were really great as well. So I feel like I've joined a real like, family oriented club and something that um, I'm really looking forward to being part of. Now you've had experience in the league before. Uh, Brentford spells at Exeter as well, but you notoriously play for Aldershot. You won the Aldershot Players Player of the Season and the Supporters Player of the Season. Um, how eager are you now to prove yourself back in the Football League with the Valiants? Yeah, I'm really eager. You know, I had a really good season last year. Um, away from the accolades and stuff, you know, I'm just really happy that I played as many games as I had played. Um, and yeah, obviously I got the awards as well. Couldn't do it about my teammates, or the fans as well, and the manager. So I'm just looking to emulate the same type of performances and even improve on those in the Football League. And like I said, just be part of a um, team that are just trying to achieve what we want to achieve and part of um, something that I think is going to be really good. Now, how brilliant would it be to get the supporters player of the season in your first season here at Port Vale? What can the fans expect to see from you this year? Uh, yeah, that would be great, you know, but that's something that I'm not really thinking of right now. I just want to be able to perform and uh, just have the team to do well. If I don't win any accolades, that's all right. As long as the team does well, I'm happy with that. But um, as a player... Um, Quite dynamic, strong, uh, good on the ball, and yeah, team player. I think that's something that I pride myself on being. We were just talking there uh, before we start this interview. You're you're really eager and hungry to start the season. We've got our first pre-season match coming up soon in July. I bet you're excited to get the Val shirt on and start playing. Yeah, I'm happy that there's a lot of games. You know, hopefully that should mean less running because we've got a lot of games. <laughs> but um, yeah, I'm eager to play. Um, from ugh, as soon as the season ended, I just wanted to start again. So I'm eager to get going in July. And yeah, um, however many games we've got, hopefully I'll be involved in all of them. Now we've had a look around the stadium today, around Val Park. What did you make of it all? Yeah, it's a great stadium. You know, um, I haven't played it before, um, and everyone who I know who has played it told me it's a big pitch. Uh, it gets a great atmosphere on match days. And yeah, looking around it, like it's a great, great stadium, a massive pitch, something that probably benefits me and my style of playing so I'm looking forward to turning out here and having some good performances here for the fans.